All right, folks, welcome back to Hacking Ola's Pachoo Shop. And right now we're going to have a look at the Deprecated Interface Challenge. And it tells us use a deprecated B2B interface that was not properly shut down. So what we got to do over here right now is we got to have a logged in user. And I'm logged in right now with test at hacksplain.com. And what I'm going to do is I'm searching for the B2B interface. And I can actually let you know that the interface is the complaint interface over here that we are going to use. So let's just quickly have a look at what this page is doing. So it seems like this allows me to send a complaint to the shop, which has a message which comes with a maximum character length of 160 characters, and I can attach an invoice. So let's click on that. Okay, so we see that the supported types are PDF and a zip file. So let's do one thing. I don't want to send a PDF or a zip file. I want to send something different. And what you could usually do is you could just send this to your repeater or your, your bird in general and try to check all other sorts of supported types. Just go through a list of files that you have in your on your file system. But what I want to do is I want to go a little different way. I want to go to the debugger again and open up our main JS file, wait until it's loaded, and then use the search functionality in here to search for zip. Let's see what we can find while we're doing this. Zip code, zip code, zip code. Actually brings us to a lot of zip code related stuff, but let's keep going. And wait a minute, we found allowed mind types. So this sounds pretty interesting. This might be related to that. And what can we see over here? We see that next to PDF files and zip files, we're actually allowed to send XML files as well. So let's try to use those. I will close the developer tools. We don't need them anymore. And I will browse and say, I want to see all the files in a specific folder. And I've prepared a little XML file for you. I can show you how the file looks like in burp. I'll just quickly open up burp and intercept this request. And for the message part of it, I just say ASDF. And then I submit it. I see burp popping up. And you can see my test XML file in here. It just says author, explain, origin, YouTube, and nothing really interesting in it. Uh, okay, so let's send this for to the server. Uh, is the WebSocket coming in? I will just click this button and see what we have found over here. You successfully solved the challenge deprecated interface. Actually, we solved another one, and this is the error handling one. Provoke an error that is neither very graceful nor consistently handled. So let's just go back to our history and let's look at that. I think it was this post request over here and if we look at the response it says it's gone and this works something that is interesting in here is the title in here it says b2b customer complaints while file upload have been deprecated for security reasons test.xml so this might be a little hint that we have to put down for a later part of hacking over shoe shop so one thing that I want to give you on your way of becoming a successful hacker is always explore the response and see if there are further hints in it. You might want to put down notes for the reminder of your test and maybe find some more juicy stuff in here. All right, this was it for the deprecated interface part. Thanks for watching. Subscribe on the top right and see you again soon. Thank you.